We are definitely at a moment in time where we are seeing large chunks of the world be redefined and changed. Questioning the status quo and believing in a different world that you can go after. An idea, you have a dream about approaching that and then you go for it and you dream big. We don't see any boundaries. The beauty of a virtual platform is you can deliver it wherever you are. It's about changing the way that we interact with our physical world and how we build our physical world. Starting an online business is easier than ever before. You don't really need much besides a MacBook Air and, uh, and a coffee shop to sit down and, uh, and you code something up, you put it on the internet and you see if it works. We are transferring tens of millions on a daily basis right now. Uh, definitely the competitors have, have started noticing us. We thought that, look, why don't we try and deliver most of the healthcare most people need right from the convenience of their mobile. We're trying to get it to a place that it doesn't matter if you're a doctor in Rwanda or a doctor in Harley Street. You have access to the same knowledge that will help you deliver the same answer to the, to the patients with the same problem wherever they are. And that is a huge achievement. I'm a very proud Indian and I want to see our country succeed. It's been staggering to say the least. Today, you know, we have operations in about 25 countries. Uh, we have people all over the globe. We are one of the largest players on the advertising platform on the planet today, competing with the likes of Google and Facebook and giving them a fight for their money. The beauty of the entrepreneurship is, is all about making decisions with 10% information. I have two phones. Each one dies every single day. Not only am I forgetting to bring my chargers everywhere, but you know, a bigger problem is where am I gonna plug them in? So we're making it so that you can walk into any room and simply lift your devices in the air and charge them with the same experience as Wi-Fi. Building robots is hard and it's been a long road, but we're starting to see robots really infiltrate society in lots of ways. We're trying to change the nature of robots by making robots that are safe for people to be up close with and such that ordinary people can train the robots. I think the kinds of things that we'll start seeing are things like household robots that help clean up around the house or do household chores, um, maybe care for the elderly. Um, I think we'll have things like, we're already starting to see things like self-driving cars. So I think the entire transport system may be revolutionizing. One of the very first places that we shared the idea with was in the uh, comfort of peers in Founders Forum and we had invaluable uh, uh, reflections and thoughts from our peers on what we should do better and what we got right. To educate uh, you know, a lot of the rest of the world about what we're doing with UBeam was an enormous opportunity for us, and uh, Founders Forum made that happen. You know, I met Prince Andrew, we went to his castle. We had access to a large crowd of uh, investors, but also partners, potential partners for us, and also potential clients. So we're still working uh, with a lot of those people we met at the Founders Forum, so it was perfect for us. Founders Forum is a great place to connect with people who are trying to change the world.